Welcome back to my Let's Play for Seventh Dragon. It's time to continue our climb. Yeah, I took out that other dragon. It's actually guarding um a minotaur, an axe with 120 attack power. Oh yeah, this forest full of T-Rexes that attack you. I forgot. <laughs> so yeah, if you don't move on them, they come to you. Like, what's that? Is it a human? I hate humans. I suppose that's how it goes. And yeah, while I was climbing my way over here, um, my um, safe walk faded away while my invisible was up, so I took some damage without even realizing it. Oops. But it's alright. I can bounce back. Though I suppose on the plus side, I don't think two T-Rexes could fit on the screen, so I don't think you can fight two of them at once. Just for the best, in my opinion. Just imagine trying to take on two of these guys. Be quite the handful. I know, I keep trying to guard the rear, and I keep getting bitten for it. This thing's like, I don't want to attack the rear, I want to go after the front line. You know, whatever works for it, I guess. Okay. At least it's slowly making me have to expend all my mana, right? I really need to get an upgrade there. Oh, finally going after the back row. With that group all damage. But it's not particularly impressive. At least not with the wall up. You cannot get past my wall! It is more impenetrable than the wall that Trump wants to build. I mean, come on. It's unbeatable. Yeah, I guess if it kept up on that whole back wall attacking relentlessly, it might actually get somewhere. But just pop me every now and again just ain't gonna be enough. Ah, it went slow that time, huh? Darn you. You messed up my timing. <sighs> I hate when they do that. Oh, an impotent little arm? <laughs> Everyone make fun of the T-Rex. It has an impotent little arm. It's like, I want to kill you, but can't reach. There we go. Plus five. Hmm. I was worried about that. suppose we can work on raising our defenses. Might as well go all in on the defense buffing at this point. You know, it's our best other option here. Huh. Gotcha. Problem is you gotta set these off in the right order, if I remember correctly. I just don't remember what that order is. There should be a clue somewhere. <sighs> I'll find it, eventually. If I search the room, but first things first, I should probably clear it of T-Rexes. Right? This would be a lot easier if I didn't have to protect my sorry but Let's see, we'll throw that there. That plus five recovery will at least make, you know, highwaying them, you know, stop taking mono losses and trying to do the defense work here. Which is good. I mean, if I'm losing a little on, you know, Lena, that's alright, you know. After all, she can always exit if she gets too low. I can, you know, hit up the recovery potion, pour, <laughs> boiling potion outside, and then come back in. But I really don't have to worry about everyone else at the same time, you know, it's enough just to keep a track on one character's MP. Well, yeah. I was gonna say TP for a second, but that's, um, Etrian Odyssey, ain't it? <laughs> Similar, but not the same. Though I have been thinking of working on some of the other entries in that series, as well as going back to the first one, because I kind of stopped in the middle of that game. But I keep putting it off. Ugh. Well, for now I want to finish the planned updates for 7th Dragon. That way, you know, I got something else that I'm just done with for the month, you know, I can be satisfied. So, like, I got all the Pokemon videos for the month, you know, taken care of at this point. So at least that got done. <sighs> There's still a lot of um, PS2 updates I want to do, though. 
I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with Final Fantasy um, 10 though. Um, my bandwidth's getting kind of low this month, so I don't really want to, you know, go flipping through sites needlessly. But at the same time, I don't want to miss out on the primers. Though I suppose I'm um, just looking up that information wouldn't be too much data, right? So I suppose I should do that, you know, before I get even closer to not having any bandwidth left at all. Ooh, so close. I was hoping for the ambush, but got shot down. Just before I could hit him, he just turned his head and he's like, Nope. Not on my watch. He's like, I could see it coming from behind. I heard you snap those twigs. I'm like, damn it. I knew he'd hear me. Well, time to make a roasty toasty T-Rex. Suppose I can make Barney jokes, but... Quite frankly, let's not talk about Barney the Dinosaur. <sighs> Pretty sure I had a plush when I was a kid, actually. And I remember playing my fair share of Barney games. Not something I particularly like admitting to, but why not? <sighs> but it's easy to make fun of them nowadays, you know, now that I'm older. Maybe a little too easy. Oh yeah, might want to switch up what skill I'm actually casting on myself. It's not like I get boosts from casting it multiple times. It's not that kind of skill. That applies to some techniques, not this one. Like the um, poison thing, you actually can stack up percentages on if you keep boosting it. But only to a certain extent, I think, because only as long as that status effect stays in effect will that work. I have thought about, you know, going back and replaying the game again after I get done with this run to build a team that just focuses on spreading poison, you know, just to show it that it can work um, if you're willing to set up the investments into it. But that's for another time, right? Then I've also thought about running a team of just four princesses and seeing, you know, how their various builds all work together with, you know, holy voice, evil voice, and all that stuff. You know, can I build a team that, you know, spreads so much stats the enemy never gets a chance to really attack at all? The problem is, I think that would still be a team that would be reliant on, you know, a fighter or something to lower an enemy's resistance. Darn it. I got too high. Or I should say, I came down too low. Ugh. Can't talk right tonight. I feel like I'm starting to come down with something too. Ugh, just been feeling like my throat's full of crud lately, and I'm feeling a bit hot. Hopefully, it's nothing too major. Ugh, I got a lot of episodes I'd like to try and push through. You know, I want to get done with before the end of the month. If I have to, I'm just gonna have to start focusing on certain games. And just Doing all the updates at once, you know, and spreading out the um, days they get cleared. And that's why I did with Ruby last night. Did all three episodes in a row, then, you know, spread out the days they'd clear on the um, channel. I suppose that's rather boring talk now, ain't it? <sighs> Man, it's a good thing T Rexes don't rely on those little arms of there, right? I assume they'd just be like an alligator or something, just like, go for a big bite with their teeth from an ambush position, just go for almost an instant kill, or deliver a massive blow and then let their enemy bleed out and then just follow them. Well, I guess not enemy, prey would be the more appropriate term. Um, yeah, I'll throw that Ikaru. Ah, man. That Tyrodan skill is really slow to go off. He's messing up my strategy. That's alright. I can work with it. Doing it again, huh? Nope. I guess we're just a bit, little bit faster than the T-Rex. That's alright. Well, now... 
I'm definitely gonna have to heal Hikari before I um get in another um dragon battle. <sighs> He's taking quite the licking. Huh. Well, no. <sighs> I'm not sure what to do here. Should be a node with writing on explaining which one to open. Or do I have to go up one of the other sides to get it? I mean, I can do that. Okay, we'll leave here and come back. I'll take some damage walking through this, I don't care. I mean, the water's right there to drink, right? Do it again if I have to. Okay, um, is the password up on this side? I mean, if I have to, you know, I can guess. It's just... I don't like doing that. Because brute forcing your way through something, especially if you know if it requires, you know, four buttons, is rather time consuming, so. I'm willing to spend some time looking. Okay, so another worm. Well, for now, let's, um, set up a moonlight song, start working our way through this. Oh, yeah. Nothing I can do right now, so. I'll just, you know, swing for the fences. Ah. Really messed me up there, man. Uh, I can't unseal myself either. Uh. This bites. Thanks for helping out the back row there. Okay, let's get Moonlight Song up. You know, at least try to. I gotta get Hikaru's um, health back up since she's taking a licking. I mean, the others I'm not as worried about. After all, I can probably get their health back up, you know, with some life recovery. Um, I guess I'll throw one Lena's way. I don't want to lose my main damage dealer. Ah, and then Pyway got shut down. Okay. This thing's nasty. <sighs> yeah, like, it keeps messing up my strats. Like, horribly. Well, now, flame, and, um, I guess defend. Come on, Pyway, I need you to get unsealed. Well, now, um, whip. You have to go with an EX skill again. I'm gonna have to leave here and go heal at some point just to get my, um, EX is back on Pyway because she's been just losing them to freaking worms, you know, just locking her up when I need her. Freaking blows. <sighs> freaking ability to steal stuff away. That silence wind skill's freaking annoying. Especially since it keeps padding these battles out. I don't want them piled out. Head out. I want it over. Okay. Attack again. Hopefully. For at least a little bit. Ah. Well, that attack doesn't mean much to me. It's the silent stuff I don't want to deal with. You know, a little group damage. Just, who cares? Okay, let's knock you out. Okay. Let's see, do I want to go up this way? Okay, there doesn't seem to be anything over there. 
Maybe the password is in the bottom corner of the first air, first floor, you know? That might be worth checking out. Okay, some spike beetles. Okay. I think I can, um, burn you out. And, um, defend, I guess. Jeez, 40? Don't mess with the beetles, I guess. They will mess you up. Well, defend. Darn it, I wanted to heal that turn. Ouch. Well, at least I don't think I can fight two worms, so the other one I'm not going to have to worry about. Okay, let's um flame you out of existence. Yeah, get rid of the 40 damage. I can always, you know, get the other worm later since I'm probably going to have to go that way anyway. Oh, darn it. Well, now shield rear. Since I don't need to do any of that, let's try and pop this sucker, you know, old school style if I have to. Yeah, that's not going to work very well. I really need Lena back. Okay, let's um, volcano this. That'll work, right? Whew. That was lucky. And it's a little off my mind that I don't have to worry about, you know? Hopefully for at least a little bit. Man, even when I try and prepare for these guys, they still manage to throw me for a loop. <sighs> yeah, I'm not looking forward to fighting another one. At least not if it's at the same time, man. That would just be too much. Just imagine after dealing with that, they just constantly lock you out of your spells and stuff. This is not a team that does well without access to magic. Darn it. Well, my damage output's gonna be in the crapper for a few turns. Well, at least I still have my healer and, um, my knight. That'll help. If only there was a way to cure that. Without using expensive items. That I don't carry, usually. Ugh. I didn't think you were going to do that multiple turns in a row. No, no, no. I got access to magic again. Please use it. Please don't stop me, dragon. Thank you, dragon. That was very kind of you. <laughs> it's gonna screw me over eventually, though. It's the law of the jungle. The dragon must give you the bone. And not in a good way. It's gotta attach razor blades first, you know? Ooh. It's ugly. Really ugly. Boom. Oh, there we go. Let's keep whacking away. Just gotta keep chipping away until it falls over. You know, it's like we're working a dig or something. Used to play a game where you dig up fossils, actually. Then put them together to find out what they were. Almost always end up being like a plesiosaurus, though. Sort of got tired of seeing it after a while. It's like, can it be something besides a plesiosaurus? What about, like, the tri tri the Triceratops? Was so I gonna go for the Tyrannosaurus Rex? I think I saw that once or twice. Okay. What's in here? Ah, uh, just a heal aerosol. Oh my um walk safe wore off, huh? Well I need that back up. I mean I gotta walk on hazardous terrain all the time. Ha <laughs> ha! You thought you had the jump on me, didn't you? 
but Piway saw it coming. Well, let's flame that one out. Ow. Ooh, only got Hikaru. Well, I lost my rear guard, but I can finish this fight up, so it's alright. As long as it doesn't spread stats again, I should be fine. But that's why I love having detect enemy. It makes that stuff a bit easier, you know, I don't have to worry about being ambushed, you know, at pivotal moments. Because that just sucks. There's nothing like being ambushed while you're in the middle of exploring a dungeon for the first time. Just really ruins the mood. Um, shield rear. I think I can work a recovery off these guys. After all, all they really do is hit really hard. So, you know, taking 40 damage is, is annoying, but as long as it's mostly focused on Hikaru, it shouldn't be a big deal. I mean, that's what she's, the, she's there for, you know? She's meant to eat attacks so others don't have to. That's why she's the knight. Well. Let's get a little recovery going that way. I admit getting her um, ma back up is a bit of a pain. suppose I can do that now, though. You know, just be like, everyone guard and just tank those blows, you know? Yeah, not too much yet. And I should now be back up to basically full mon everyone, right? So let's just burn you and be done with it. Here it comes, Spike Beetle. The Flame of Doom. Sounds like the name of a supervillain or something. Oh, some stairs. Nice. Huh. Well, now. Let's see. I guess we gotta deal with some little dragons. Darn it, I was too close. Oh, that one's gonna jump in too. Aw, oh, man. Everyone wants a piece of me. Everyone. How joyous, I guess? They got good taste, at least. Nature song. Shield rear. Suppose I could heal Pi away, but whatever. I'm trying to soften this target up, you know, before the other one jumps in. Well, let's finish you off. Highway, um, heal yourself, will you? You know, before one of the dragons gets you with suckle. It's gonna suckle on you in ways that are just completely inappropriate. Ways we shouldn't talk about. Maybe I should use an EX skill on Lena. Go for a little extra damage, you know, on the fire. Eh, I think we can get by without it. Though, we might want to make sure we're recovering Hikaru. She's going to be taking, you know, that many attacks for us. Ah, lost her defensive buff again. Well, that's alright. We can make this work out. Come on, I'm daring you to go after Ikaru. I'm prepared. Why do you keep erasing her defensive buff? That's so evil of you. But I suppose it is an effective way to screw me over, right? Like, just take off her health recovery. That'll do it. You're really not going to let me get defense set up again, are you? You're like, I'd like to suckle away your defenses, because I'm a baby dragon and I'm super cute! Super cute, super cute, super cute. 
I don't see it. Sorry, guys, the face only a mother could love, right? But I guess that's what's going for. It's got its own theme song and everything. Like Baby Shark, only it's Baby Dragon. Just over and over and over again. Ooh, a dragon kebab. Ah, you fade away again, huh, walk safe? Well, I caught you, so it ain't gonna work. Huh. A flute. Interesting. I didn't think I needed a flute. Ah. Um. I'm tempted. Not a lot, but I am tempted. I mean, I know they spread sleep. But I think I can work with it. If I'm careful. Or lucky. Well, I guess I gotta pull a Terry Harry. You feel unlucky, punk? And I'm like, yeah. Yeah, I am. Stupidly lucky. Let's see what I got. But I have to admit, this is probably going to eat up most of the rest of the time in the episode. <sighs> this place is just too big and too full of dragons. But, at least we're slowly wearing down their numbers here. Come on, show what you got. Oh, a little dragon appeared. Well, I'm afraid you're not going to have to die. Sorry, it's a absolute binding contract here. It's in, it's in the small print. Ah, you put to sleep. Calm, huh? That was awfully nice of you, little dragon. She looks like she could need a nap, you know? She's been awake, you know, for three days straight. A lot of tension in her back, you know? Just, just couldn't take it. Ooh, 316. Not bad. Um, here. Might as well let her get awake and from sleep rudely. Well, now, um, attack, shield rear. Let's, um, flame that one out. I was hoping she'd be able to pick up the kill. I guess I overestimate her a little bit. That's alright. We always get our, van our dragon eventually. Ooh. Pretty hard to sleep so she can't use back block here. Interesting, interesting. Ooh, you're sucking off Lena's defenses now, huh? How rude of you. Well... Time for a little recovery magic. Um, invisible again. Don't mess with me, I'm invisible. Eh, still in play. Well, no. Gotta keep checking that, you know, just in case. You never know when it's gonna wear off. You know, you suddenly look and you're like, oh man, I'm missing a bunch of hit points. Like I should have been looking earlier. Seven? Well, now. Moonlight Song. Shield Rear. Flame. Definitely want to heal Hikaru. I fear she's gonna end up being the center of attention here. No, assuming that one doesn't shed a ton of needles my way. Well, that's alright. That thing's getting picked off next. Then I think I'll let the um, worm wander in while I'm all buffed up. It seems like an ideal opportunity to pick it off, in my opinion. Now I'm going to be heading in its direction next anyway, so... Either way. It's got to go down. Why not do it on my terms?
Okay, let's defend this turn. And you defend as well, Pyway. I suppose I could technically have everyone defend, it wouldn't make much of a difference. After all, this thing can't really pierce my defenses too hard. Ooh, much as I'm gonna recover, wow. Good work there, Beetle. You're truly showing me who's boss. Oh no, a uh, worm appeared like I thought it would. Whatever shall I do? I never thought this would happen. Oh wait, I did. I know, my sarcasm sucks. I need to work on it more. I just don't have time. It's always escaping me, you know? Like a simple rhyme. Well, throw on Hikaru again. Ah, group damage, eh? So that's one way to annoy me. <sighs> How many more turns is this gonna take? Too many. Well, no. Throw it on Lena. This is not trying to steal our skills more. It seems really content to just try and blow everyone up all at once. Bit of a weird pick that way. It's like this one plays slightly different from all the rest. Oh, here we go. Well... I can work with this. I mean, the only one truly inconvenienced is Piway. Because she's lost access, you know, to recovery. Well, just have to hope this doesn't last very long. I mean, if worse comes to worse, I suppose I can start defending with everybody. Um, attack. Just probably still can't heal. Maybe this turn. Maybe. Well, I guess it doesn't matter since he us how the dragon's dead. <sighs> Okay, Bloom Seed, maybe? No, of course not. Why would I expect a Bloom Seed? Okay. Let's just, um, try and escape the Mammoth. I don't really want to fight it right now. I mean, it'd be a good thing to recover on, but... Not the expense at the moment. Well, next time, you know, I'll come back and finish off the rest of the dragons on this floor and, you know, continue to try and unlock the upstairs for this tower, as well as see if I maybe missed any, um, passwords in the back over around here. I don't have high hopes for it, but maybe. Until next time, then. See ya.